to lies. I did. You were forced to, to lie. Yeah. I got black market Mario coming after this, trying to provide his steroids to Wii Fit Trainer. And she says, no, I am an honest yoga teacher. Look at him. He's already looking for these. He's looking for a kill at 19. I mean, it does damage. Damage is damage. Nice is nice. We're throwing out that DP raw. Coltman's main advantage of this Dr. Mario is just the amount of pressure he can throw out. Even on a stage like, uh, even on a stage like PS2, while he loses the Mario combos, Mar Dr. Mario's frame data is still roughly, and, and buttons are still just as powerful as Mario's can be. You just end up playing a lot more neutral. Whether that's a good or bad thing can often depend on the player. We're gonna miss Luigi's keeping his back to, or keeping his face to the ledge and waiting for waiting for Coltman to overextend. Not knowing not to punish. Well that's something we haven't really we never really touched on all that much. The man, near nearly living. Or nearly dying. This game is so much more even than I originally oh, right, given it credit. You missed uh, well you called it. And that the dock was coming out first, and this game, and he took the first dock. So Coltman is currently living and thriving off of what could be a lead that he can extend. 162, though. Yeah, yeah, too much, too much nice on him to actually mount anything. Dock requiring to get close and doesn't isn't the best at extending the lead when compared to a, his other character, it's a snake. Yeah, all right, now we're seeing this ledge play once more. And, uh, oh. Yeah, yeah, like, oh man, the, the damage output for both of these characters is honestly almost equivalent. Like, Doc does so much good on, that was, he went where? He came from whence and went to what? Get, get your protractors, everybody, because that was the perfect angle. <laughs> that will be on the test. <laughs> <laughs> if a if a Wii Fit trainer s headers a Dr. Mario at 40 at whatever it was height 30 pixels up what angle is he sent at that he'll die <laughs> you have 30 minutes <laughs> oh man the up close frame data is proving to uh, the up close frame data on top of these pills is proving to be just enough of the original snake game plan where he's trying to force Wii Fit off the spot, stop them from charging and getting the deep breathing with the grenades and C4s and all that. Pills are doing the same thing, but he's complemented by a stronger slew of aerials and a better out of shield game. Is wow, he almost died. Reflect, I, I also I love the way that he's using these pills in like these very tiny situations. Just give him the leeway to find a way back down to the ground. But those pills, unlike grenades, do not stop sun salutations from hitting him right in the face. So, but even even still, even though he lost that game, I think he was doing very well. That one, I think that was kind of based on Di when he died from that uh, the side B. I think he probably could have angled himself to at least land onto the stage. Um, so I think that sticking with Doc is probably the right call. I think that the Doc is doing fine. Definitely putting a lot more uh, pressure and, you know, scaring Luigi just more than his snake was before. Especially if he, if he gets the chance to, to go back to Smashville, make it three for three. We did hear them exit and re-enter the arena. So a change in stage, I would think, is in order. Three. I'm gonna have Battlefield. Interesting. Um, he banned it. He banned it. Oh, oh, right, right, right. Of course, of course. Ooh. He's at 21. You're trying to kill him. <laughs> that downer almost killed. I, I underestimated Doc Downer. I did not know Doc Downer did that. If, without a jump and uh, the added the added benefit of the spike property 
reducing or raising the bottom blast zone whenever you uh, whenever you land one. So spikes are meant to kill in this game, regardless of percent. Nintendo wants you to die. Battlefield is such an iffy pick, because once again, you're losing the benefit that Mario gets on this stage. Doc doesn't really have as many ladders, but what he gains is what he gains is weight, and Bla Battlefield has a relatively large blast zones while still having the smaller stage. I don't which... think Dr. Mario is heavier than Mario. Is he not heavier? I thought it was heavier. I don't think he... We can double check this, but I actually don't think he's heavier. He just feels heavier. He does... Well, he's certainly a lot slower, so it's... His yeah. fall speed may be more. Let's find out. Let's find out. Uh, wait. We're learning together, everybody. If I'm wrong, uh, then I'm, I'm stupid and dumb. If I'm, cut off if, my critics. If I'm wrong... No, you are one indeed correct. They are both 98 weight, which is the same as corn. Today I learned. <laughs> And today we figured out that maybe Battlefield wasn't exactly the right pick, or at the very least, Luigi Jesus has properly adapted to the Dr. Mario matchup as things are starting to to teeter to the out of control. Yeah, it's hard to tell what, you know, which is what in this particular situation. Um, but definitely this game, I'm not gonna say it's a lost cause, but there's, you can still gain a lot of information you know, still try to, you know, figure out as much as you can. For instance, if you are going to switch back to the snake, uh, you can, you know, figure out some of those habits that you can dissect for later. Um, but as it stands, that's going to be game two. Right now, Luigi's just moving up. Oh, one more game is all he needs in order to win this whole tournament. And it seems like that's just... His, you know, we're, we're getting close to midnight. He wants to, he wants to be in bed by 11.59. He doesn't want to. He doesn't want to drag this out for a ten-game series. Nah, nothing like that. He wants to. It, it's. It's. For him, it's. It's all but over. Yeah, this is. It, it was X or Coltman. You were prepared to play both, whether it was the Snake, the Doc, or the Marth. Like you had advantage on all of them. I'd rather it be. Maybe not statistically against the doc, but no matter what, this character was and would end up being a counterpick character, and you can win. You can win against a counterpick character. So think, now, oh. do you think he's gonna stay doc for game three, or do you think he's gonna switch back to snake? Uh, I would think a switch. Oh, man, like I think he would probably keep going with the doc. Just commit to it. I think. I, I think. Gonna, I think. I think we might see Snake in game. Whoa. Okay. Everything we knew was wrong. Certainly yeah, a that... third character. I've not quite. I've not heard of in Coltman's arsenal, but sure. But, but, <laughs> I thought he was gonna do some suicide shenanigans over there. Okay, yeah, I have never seen his Falco, um, but Falco on Battlefield, is, that's one of his better stages, I believe. Um, let's see if he's able to do some of those, like, Falco combos that the character is so notorious for. Um, I'm wondering why exactly he chose Falco. Falco, of course, does have a very long-lasting, aggressive uh, reflector, which we've been seeing him sort of casually here and there start throwing out. But as it stands at the moment, this is pretty even. This is not that bad of a situation for him. Granted, I think part of that is maybe Louis Jesus is uh, adjusting and, you know, sort of studying uh, this Falco before he can maybe try and ultimately dissect it. It's, it's going to take a decent bit, but I, what Falco gives is a, and a lot of it's a lot of the tools that he was trying to use as Dr. Mario, like really solid horizontal edge garden tools a pretty good reflector falco's being infinitely better uh, as it just starts reflecting on frame one uh, a a good projectile albeit one a little bit more linear and without a doubt the depth of combo game may just keep momentum in his favor as opposed to surrendering it every time he got a hit at doc yeah one thing that he doesn't have with uh 
Falcon that he did have a dock is those pills, which I felt like a lot of the time would get him out of the really bad, like, trapped in the corner situation just by being able to wave bounce and, add, you know, add an extra hitbox. And this game, it feels like this Falco has been very continuously trapped in the corner and had damage tacked on, tacked on, tacked on. And now he is on possibly his tournament life, already taken 70 in the blink of an eye. This is looking grimmer and grimmer for, uh, Coltman by the second, but right as I say that, gets a cool 70% of his own. Whoa, wow. All right, that's it. Luigi just manages to sneak past him, get the back air, and that's that's a whole wrap. Xeno Wi Fi is finuto, and um, Luigi just is your champion. Yeah, that's a that's one of the quickest rack up, wrap ups to a grand finals I've seen in a hot minute ended even before midnight and it it makes sense from how luigi just was playing throughout this entire bracket to how you would see him just subtly mix up coltman at every turn like whenever coltman think the sun salutation was coming out he got f tilted or dash attacked and whenever he would think it would safe to throw out a poke the sun salutation or the soccer ball or medicine ball whichever you prefer <laughs> that came out instead and it, every instance it felt like coltman was the picking the wrong option and as soon as he started getting go getting things going it was already too late yeah Ooh. so luigi is gonna be your champion and but uh everyone today played really well and we had some